check, check. Good evening, once again, I'm Kill the Vid, your host for the 9 to 5 Outlaw Does Gaming YouTube and Twitch channel. Been off for an entire week, but I'm back again with another edition of Let's Play Classic featuring Grand Theft Auto 4, main storyline on the 9 to 5 Outlaw Does Gaming YouTube and Twitch channel. To recap. It's been a while since the previous stream. I decided to do the snowstorm mission and I finally succeeded and it's been revealed that Michelle was a government agent the whole time tracking Nico Bellic. And as a result, I have no other choice as Nico Bellic to work for the government. And Michelle is really Karen who makes an appearance in Grand Theft Auto 5 as well as GTA Online in the, ne in the uh, next gen. So I'm going to continue on where I'm going to finish out the Elizabetta mission as well as trying to do Francis McRary the corrupt police chief who is of course part of the McReary crime family but he's not you know but he's kind of bending the law so I'm going to continue on with that without any further ado grab a snack grab a drink grab whatever you need it's time for let's play classic featuring Grand Theft Auto 4 on the 9 to 5 Outlaw Does Gaming YouTube and Twitch channel. Welcome to Liberty City. Here we go. So I'm going to need to contact uh, Jacob so I can get some guns delivered to me. Or come meet him at the meeting spot. That's usually how the arrangement works. Hopefully he's available. Jacob, I need to get a hold of a weapon. Can you help me? Yo, people for charge, I don't know. I'm gonna do this and then I'm gonna go do the last of this beta Torres mission. Disaster after another. Branch 
touch Brandon. Good for City Eye. I got some teeth in here, you know, Bridget. It all day, my brother. First things first. Get armor. Yes, that'll be it. Later, Mayo. Call me, Auntie. Let's go see Elizabeth.
hit that car. Oh no, this car's We're going to San Quentin. Let's do it. Thanks. Man, this is getting out of control. The police are all over me. I can feel them. So? 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 So I'm gonna go to prison for a long time. <laughs> so my life is over. Oh, God, all this work for nothing, man. Oh, being tough in a man's world. I guess I wasn't so tough, huh? Jorge turned state? Everyone's a rat! Not me. <laughs> Whatever! Open up, man! Who is it? It's the streets, man! Oh, shit. Okay! Hold on! All right, man. Oh. This is what Manny's oh. all about, man. Manny, 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 Manny! Now, man. word up, bitch! You better stop slinging that shit on my streets, yo! We don't want it anymore! Hey, OJ, you catching this? Rolling, what rolling! Is this, Manny, for fuck's the sake! The streets have spoken! Now leave my people alone! <laughs> you Rico! What are you doing here? Uh -huh. <laughs> Snuff film. Oh, I am not in the mood for this right now! Well, he said he was going to bust the dealer. Can you help me clean this mess up? There's a doctor and broker who can help. Come on. Let's put him in my car. So I gotta deliver these corpses to one of these back alley organ doctor people, surgeons or whatever as a donation. But I gotta make sure the trunk doesn't blow off because it'll expose the corpses and draw negative attention to the LCP.
Let's be cool. Thanks. Drive safely. Thanks. Got some bodies in here. I've heard you'll take care of them. Uh, natural causes? Of course. Seems like a bullet in the head is as natural as it gets in this town. <laughs> Weren't sick, were they? No. Had a few problems with sick bodies. No one wants a liver if it's riddled with tumors, huh? Know what I mean? No. Shit. Looks like the bullet went right through this one's eye. And the price of eyes is through the roof at the moment. <laughs> Fine. Can I leave you with these or what? Sure. I'll have these organs out on the street in no time. They're gonna help a lot of folks. <laughs> He'd been trying to help the streets his whole life. Maybe he'll actually be doing it now. <laughs> for this. Hmm. Okay. Last call for Elizabeth. The doctor has that stuff. Good! One last thing to bother me. The heat is closing in, Nico. This particular party is ending. Another happy customer. That's great. Read about crime and corruption. Today's newspaper, Naked Chicks and Global Warming. Nico, I'm getting worried. Roman didn't get back at all last night. He likes to party. He stays out late the whole time. You know what he's like. Not on my watch, he don't. Something ain't right. Get your news here, periodicos. Read about the misfortunes of others. <laughs> Feel better about yourself by a Nico, it's Patrick McCreary. You and me did some work for Elizabeth Torres together? You mean I saved your ass? Well, if I'd have known it was such a big deal to you, I would have asked you to let them kill me. Anyway, if you're in need of extra funds, I'm in need of a good man. Come over to Mama's on Savannah Avenue in Meadows Park. I'm always in need of money. See you there. So I just got a call from Patrick McCreary. 
So now, since Elizabeth's gone, the McCreary crime family enters the picture. Where you going, man? I want to go to uh, Zeno time. So I'm gonna go to the safe house in Algonquin, which is much nicer. And uh, some hands and beat up the coochie. Thanks a lot. Hello there. Now I'm going to go downtown to go see Karen. Sit back and enjoy the ride. Take me to Iron Street. Sorry about the smell. I just laid some gas in here. Oh. No tip for you. Except lay off the beans. Here we are. It's a wrap. Douchebag. Hey. Hi. Listen, I know what you must be thinking, but don't bother. I'm sorry, but I don't see how you know what I must be thinking. You've killed people. You should be dead yourself. Or inside. You're just lucky it was me and not someone else who got their hooks into you. I'm sorry that I lied to you. And, and weirdly, in some ways, you're a nice guy. Better than the creeps I normally date. But you're damaged goods. No doubt. Let's go. Boys, flag In ball. here. Salute? Eat my ass, buddy. I'm up for the promotion. You're not. <laughs> What the hell are we doing here? We're going to meet someone. Sounds fun. You know, you and your cousin, you should get out. What you're looking for, you won't find. Feds are all over it. Crime is done. You've watched too many movies. Whatever you say, Michelle. Or whatever your name is. It's Karen. My name is Karen. Interesting. And you whore for the government. I kind of like the honesty in that. I have a clear conscience. How very lucky for you. <sighs> in here, Office 396. Hi there. Here he is. I can see that. Thanks, Karen. Hey, cheer up. You did good. 
You'll get a Sammy, if you care about that sort of thing. Thank you. So, Mr. Bellic, quite a fire, quite a story. Who are you? If I be? If I be? Do I look homosexual? <laughs> do you think I care about the size of your Johnson? Now, you can't always tell who the good guys are. I'm not a good guy, but I'm fighting with them. And guess what? So are you. Hooray. That's the spirit. Nothing like a bit of sarcasm when someone's got you by the balls. Now, I need you to find something out for me. Find out everything you can about a man called Oleg Minkoff. He lives on Iroquois, back in Hove Beach. And if I say no? I hand your file over to those cretins in the FIB, and organized crime has dealt another serious blow. Go to his house. Any problems, call this number. Hmm. What's your name? Not relevant. Call me. Very soon. Go. And hey, welcome to America. Pascal Stara Dejava. Bushka. So this character reappears in Grand Theft Auto V, known as only as ULP, but in the online DLC, he's with his actual name is revealed. At least part of it as uh, Bernard. Let's go see Minko. Oleg Minko. So can you take me to Broker Bridge? Okay. Mr. Minkov? Anybody here? What have you got for me? Not much. He keeps a clean house, he's got a computer. Check his emails. Call back with any information that would indicate his current whereabouts. Let's go to the laptop computer. Lies, damn lies, dot net. Read his emails. From Vasily. Oleg, come on, you're acting crazy. You aren't being watched by government spies. Your phone is in tap. You don't need to drink that bottled water or eat from those tins because no one wants to poison you. Please get into that. Get into your head. Anyway, of course I'll meet you. I'll be outside the jewelry shop of, off Tulsa Street later on. See you, Vasily. Constantine. Dear Oleg, I can't give you any more of the information you want. I am emailing my contacts in the Caspian and keep getting reports that the addresses no longer exist. Also, the companies you want info on seem to be owned by Umbrella Corporations, which are owned by even more Umbrella Corporations. Tracing the money, I reach dead ends in either the Caymans or Switzerland. Sorry, I cannot help you further. Constantine.
Dear Mr. Minka, it has come to our attention that you are attempting to publish a manuscript rife with inaccuracies and salacious allegations. A client who wishes to remain nameless will pursue a case of defamination of character should this manuscript ever be published. Cease and desist your endeavor. Yours respectfully, Larry Legner, Attorney at Law. There's an email that says he's meeting someone at Tulsa Street in Hove Beach. Perfect. I'll send someone to pick up the hard drive. You go to Tulsa Street. Eliminate Minkoff. Whoa. Killing is very different from gathering information. You are acting in the interest of your new countrymen and keeping yourself out of prison. For what? Phone call got disrupted because I nearly got hit by a vehicle. So there's that. So let me uh, get a cab. You want to stop, man? Ah, I'm damn gonna it! Break you. Taxi! Stop, you prick! So can you take me to Mohawk Avenue? Yes? Hey, okay, yeah, can problem. Can you drive quick? Late for a big date, friend. Yeah, we're gonna whack someone. Okay, friend, here we are. Great, thanks. Oleg. Василий, спасибо, что пришел. Олег, ты испугал меня. Я даже подумал, что это человек. Под... Все, он меня дожидался. Пока, братан. Can't escape from me, King Cole. This is not my car. Stop you, dipshit.
car, idiot! Minkoff is dead. The country is safe. Not by a long shot, smartass. Nothing is safe. No one is safe. Maybe something has been averted. Maybe delayed. I'll be in touch. Goodbye. I should probably do something about this. doing uh good how are you well i'm shit to be perfectly frank buddy fucking shit what terrible oh what's wrong with you me my life's a fucking train wreck i cannot believe this is happening to me bitch 
bitch! Bitch! Hey, come on, calm down. You fucking bitch! Who are you talking about? Who's this bitch? A fucking whore of a fucking wife, that's who! Okay, what did she do? Uh, my lovely bride, the mother of my son, is up there right now, fucking some prick behind my back. And after all I've done for that tramp whore, ah! Hey, you okay? Hey, come on, calm down. You're going to do yourself some serious damage if you keep going on like that. <clears throat> it's only angina. Come on, Jeff. Be calm. Jeff, be cool. Come on, champ. You can do this. Be a winner. Hey, ah. mister. Are you okay? No, I'm a winner. I can do anything. Great. See you later. Hey, you know, you could do me a favor here. <laughs> you know. Uh, what? Take some photos. Text them to me. <laughs> you want me to text you photos of your own wife? <laughs> I'll pay, buddy. I've got a black card. <laughs> I'm afraid I only take cash. I'll give you cash, all right? 500. Just follow them, take some photos, text them to me. Come on, here they come. Here's my card. He gets so angry and jealous. I don't know what to do. You up ahead? Yes, you. Could you get a bloody move on, please? Yeah? You know, I'm here for you whenever you need me. It's just that he gets so angry and jealous, I don't know what to do. I found bugs in my phone. I came home and my panty drawer was empty. Turned out he'd sent the contents to a lab for DNA analysis. It's not your fault. I trust you in his position. He wants to get a trackify chip put in the base of my spine. Says I wouldn't mind if I didn't have something to hide. Have I told you how beautiful your eyes are? I mean... It's not like I keep things from him. I just don't want to become a paraplegic or anything. It'd be criminal for a woman with legs like yours not to be able to use them. You meet a guy with a nice smile and a black card, but you don't have any idea what kind of monster he could turn into. I'm not gonna change on you. It just doesn't make sense to me. What makes him think I'd cheat on him? A girl can have male friends. It's not like every guy I hang out with is trying to screw me, is it? <laughs> You're wasted on him. The bitch! The cum-guzzling bitch! Ew. She kisses a kid with that mouth. Ah, 
I love her so much. Oh, calm, Jeff. Calm, be calm, calm. Jeff. Take your own advice, Jeff. Be calm. This doesn't necessarily mean she's cheating on you. about it. You've got enough on your plate looking after Roman. See you soon. Gracias. Have a good one. Thanks! Them money? He never tells me anything. I heard they took him to a warehouse off Long Park in Bohan Industrial. I'll check it out. Well, excuse me, asshole. Looks like Packy will have to wait. I gotta get R Roman. Hey, buddy. Take me to Long Park Avenue, okay? Here we are. Oh, thank you. Nico, I thought I would send you this line, picture. Dimitri. Looks like your cousin's in a bit of a fix. Your friend, Dimitri. some backup from Dwayne. Dwayne, it's me. Can I get that backup you offered? For sure. The boys are on their way. If Dwayne says you're cool, then you must be. Let's go.
Incendiaries. I'm Ichi. I need some more stuff. That's right. If you want to walk out of here, Slav, you're going to have to think about how you will pay your debt. A friend of mine, Dmitry Raskolov, he would pay a lot of money for your cousin. I'll get you the money, just not that way. I'm bored. Time to chase the dragon. Of course, of course! On my mark. Man, I ain't dealing no more! I don't know why I smoke this. There is no rush. I'm with you. Can I get a signal? It can take a long time to bleed to death done properly. America rocks! I got to go back to the gym. It really sucks. Oh, yeah. Shit!
Bad for you! One more! My cousin, will you? Watch out! This is Stand a lot of heat! I'm gonna take your head off! This is it for you! No one's back with my 
me! Test me! Here we go! Who do you people think you are? Gotcha. Take my cousin, will you? Man, I sold everything already. This is it for you. On the guard. We had some fun, yeah? Now go get back to your wife and kids. No one fucks with my family! You don't want to shoot again, please! Yeah, look at the bodies. Come on! Test me! Test me! You have got me! You have got me! People think you are. Go to hell. Fuck. Learn to shoot straight, asshole. I'm living here with Roman. Я тебе шею сверну, падла. You're surrounded now. Eat hard metal. My cousin, will you? One more? 
Gotcha, bitch. Hey, asshole, you are dead. Thought I did. This is it for you. <laughs> Fuck off. <laughs> You will pay for what you've done! There's more. Gonna be interesting. Bye bye. Explosion, my friend. Oh, shoot again. Controller. You have got Dead motherfuckers, aren't you? Yeah, oh, yeah. Shit. More this assholes are waiting. Right this is the part where we kill you, asshole. You sure about that? These people were with me. Did not thank you, Roman. Oh. Cut his head off. 
Oh, fuck. Hang in there, Roman! We were hoping you would come, Belik. This part is for you! Your battle would have been so much more painful if you gave us some time! Nico! Nico! I'm up here! Dimitri was right! You come to collect your fat cousin right away! Good thing we did not kill the fat cousin! I'm here for you! Can't we just all oh, be shit. friends? We are Nico Bellic. Turn around and walk away, or your cousin is dead. I am not afraid of death. When she comes for me. Thank you, cousin! You saved my life! We should get out of here! I need help like a motherfucker. There's a car. Take me home, cousin. I'm gonna have to fight my way out of here. My health is down. That was grueling. We have reports of shots fired at the warehouse off Lompoc. What happened, Roman? You have been gambling. I give you money. How are you in debt? There are cycles, cousin. You must lose a little to win a lot. Come on, my cards were not good. Wrong. That man knew Dimitri. He was trying yes, to make me give you up to him. I would never... Of course you would not. Dimitri has taken this too far. He wants you dead. <laughs> Cohen is not safe. I I I'm going to get us a place in Algonquin. Sorry. Are you okay? I'm used to taking these beatings, Nico. I almost expect it now. Wherever I go, there are people who want to kill me. Men who will kidnap me. I'll never marry Mallory. I won't be able to sleep with another college girl. There is a knife hanging over me. A clock is ticking. Careful! This people are crazy!
Man, this is out of control. I know. What are we going to do? I don't know. We're going to die. I don't want to die, man. Not like this. How would you like to die? Having a reason on my 100th birthday? I don't fucking know. I'm scared, you cold bastard. What are we going to do? I'm not cold. You're cold. All you care about is revenge and getting your own way. And all you care about is money and gambling it away on the internet. Whoa. Isn't America great? I get to sit in front of a computer and play Mr. Rich Man and get into debt with crooks. Okay, I messed up. I know I did. I thought things would be different. I, I don't understand this place so good. Oh, man, what are we going to do? Stop sitting in front of the computer gambling our money. Stop uh, getting into illegal card games. Stop spending all our money. Yes. Thank you. And stop thinking about the Russians. Men, we just need to disappear as far as they're concerned. Disappear! Okay, okay. But I want Florian and Darko. I need to know what happened. Give me that. Fine. But leave the Russians alone. I was not the one gambling in their private club. I didn't know! I give a guy a break! Okay. 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 I'm going to clean up. I have a nasty feeling I had a bit of an accident back there. And Nico. What? Thanks. You who hate! Yes, why not? I'm on my way over. Check the money. You bought it or I did? Nico, I'm offended! I've got us an apartment in Algonquin! What did I say when you got... Now you're screwed! At 
Got you in my sights. Oh, okay, shit. here we go. Put your hands on the roof. I get arrested. Fuck you. Send back up. Get up or they mato. Come on, I'm going in. Police, don't move my muscle, asshole. Stop blowing it, Jacob. I have nothing to say to you. I nearly ran into your cousin the other day. My friends were uh, hanging out with him. The party got busted up though before I got there. I wish you had been there. We could have had some fun. Not as much fun as I would have had with Roman, believe me. I want to go to Dillon Street, yeah? Here we are. It's a wrap. We sell quality weapons and we know how to use them. You're my cousin. I want you to use family business how you like. Anytime you want cab, you call me. Thank you, cousin. That could be very useful in this city. Hmm. Oh, yeah. Beautiful choice. Not available yet.
Yeah, that's it. Stay safe, stay Second Amendment. Right on, brother. Now let's go see Packy. Better than seeing the other brother who's on both on the other side of the law. Kind of. But he does corrupt shit. Where can I take you? I want to go to Savannah Avenue. I know a fun way to go. Can you drive quick? You're speaking my language now. Watching this is cinematic. Oh, living really that bad? Oh no, this is my first freaking car. Yeah, right. Oh no! Oh no! Oh no! Our leaders need to admit that they get road rage just like us. That's why they have limos. All I'm saying is that we'll all be judged in the end. All of your brothers. And you, Patrick. And you, Kate. Who's gonna judge Kate? What would she win if they did, Virgin of the Year? No. I'm thinking maybe you can catch VD for both Fuck of us, you, Patrick. Katie. <laughs> Sorry, Ma. Oh, there he is. Mr. Fucking Crazy Man. You want a beer? No. Good, because I ain't fucking got none. Very funny. Maybe if being a drunkard doesn't work out, you can be a comedian. Fuck off. <laughs> and you, Kate, fuck off out of here. But aren't you going to introduce us? Sure. This is Nico, some drug dealing to fucking generate from some armpit in Eastern Europe. That's my ma. Nice to meet you. Hi. And this is my sister, lovely lass, scared to bits of life, and fucking off out of here right now before I throw a fucking bottle at her. Patrick. Nice to meet you. Likewise. See you around. <laughs> Bye. What a girl. I think she likes you. Word to the wise, though, she don't put out. Which is convenient, because if she did, I'd have to kill you. <laughs> Understood. Good lad. You got any drugs on you, boy? No. Shit. Well, probably a good thing. We got some business to take care of. Come on. We've got business out at the docks in Algonquin. Where's your car, man? We need a car. Okay, there's a ship coming in, and we're the welcoming party. Who are we welcoming, and what have they got that makes this drive worth the effort? We're welcoming some of our cousins from the east. 
but we don't know what it is that they're bringing in. Exactly. All we know is that it's worth a dollar or two. My brother Gerald had word about it through this Italian, Ray Bacino. He gave us the heads up in exchange for a cut of the haul. What makes you think that the information is legit? First off, I don't trust this guinea for a second. We wouldn't be working for him if our family still had the same status it did back in the day. But that's another story. Am I going to hear this story? Anyone who hangs around my family hears about the old days. Just wait. Oh, yeah. Ray Bacino's a slimy motherfucker. The one thing you can rely on him for is greed. I'm too small time to be worth setting up, so the one angle he can be playing is the cash one. Makes sense. Yeah, he'll probably try to give us a fraction of whatever this stuff's worth, but it'll be a fun night. Depends on what you think is fun. A stealing, gunfire, car chases, all the usual stuff. Usual for you and me, maybe. But... Jesus Christ! Jesus Christ! That was a grade A fuck up! Okay, so once we're getting the cab, we'll just take it now. General population? That's a prison term. You ever been inside? Not in this country. In Europe. They do things different there. Not so much of the fun in the shower that you guys have here in America. Must have been a real disappointment. Bet a guy like you thought he was gonna be real popular with the lifers. Did no one pay you any attention? As I said, the whole prison bitch thing is an American phenomenon. It don't happen on the other side of the ocean. Well, you gotta do some time over here. See what you've been missing out on in your chaste European jails. I'm going to pass on that. Send me a postcard if you do some time. Will do. Might even put you on the visitors list. Ah, I'd be fucking touched. You'd be touched if you did some time, that's for sure. <laughs> they would see if they'd be able to touch me. I got some moves. You're a good man, Nico. I like you. Not in a fun in the showers kind of way. You know, a male bonding about to go rob some people kind of way. I think I know what you're saying. <laughs> Fucking hell! Never drive stuff. You better have insurance. I don't. What's your excuse? You got an itchy trigger finger, man. Yeah, well, thanks for giving up your ride. We appreciate it. Everybody's running down the street. The ambulance. Meat wagon. Here we are. What's the plan? We get up on the roof of that warehouse. There should be a good view of the dock so we can scope that shit out. Follow me, Nico. I'm late for yoga. I'm late for yoga.
So what we're about to booze is a cargo ship full Stick of, to me, man. of uh, knockoff drugs, knockoff pharmaceuticals. about this shipment. If it's just fish, I'm gonna be pretty irritated, Pecky. Hurry up, you bastard. What's the problem? Get here on my own time. This is where the deal's meant to be going down. Well, I got my sniper rifle. And here's the boat, right on time. So we're gonna boost that boat. See those boxes on the back of the boat? They must be bringing clone meds. Meds? Yeah, stuff that'll stop housewives cutting their wrists and make their husbands get wood. Well, yeah. Meds. Molly, yeah, sedatives, antidepressants, yeah. meds. Okay, how do we do it? We'll wait until the truck is loaded, then we'll take it. Simple as that. Oh, we'll steal the truck, okay. Don't even bother. I'll cover with you the from up here while you're down on the ground cleaning up. These better be some good fucking pills. Well, good the housewives the better be there. grateful. Climb down a mini cap and get to the ground. We're gonna jack a truck. You gotta jump down there to get at him, man. Alright. Gonna use a practical approach. So, we might as well just. Okay, let's do it. Let's get it on. Jesus, watch Ooh. where you're going! At least I didn't die. I could have. So.
Where to? We're going to Bismarck. Eh? Here we go. Tip, please. Oh, thank you. Hey, 
Hey, man, did you just call me? No, man. Must have been someone else. Yeah, yeah, must have been. I was in the shower and I heard the phone ringing, so I thought you might have called or something. My bad. Later. We've got business out at the docks in Algonquin. Where's your car, man? We need a car. Christ! My brother Jerry's had word from Ray Bacino, his Italian contact, about a big shipment coming in near the fish market. The triads are expecting something, and it smells fishy. The fish market smells fishy? Shit, man. I keep forgetting you're not from here. Something smelling fishy means that it ain't quite right. So this shipment smelling fishy means that it ain't gonna be what they say it is. But if it's going to the fish market, they must be saying that it's fish. So? So if this shipment is what they say it is, then it's going to smell fishy anyway. Shut the fuck up. You think you're a right <laughs> fucking comedian, don't you? Learn the damn language. Anyways, I was in Algonquin last night partying with some sweet college chicks. Yeah? You should come along next time. Really? Sure, sure. Guy like you, you'd have a good time. Unless you're hoping to see me sis again. If that's what's going through your brain, then we got ourselves a problem. I'll oh, take yeah? The, the problem's that you'll be letting yourself in for a lifetime without getting action. And I know what happens to a man when he ain't getting any. It ain't pretty. So you got yourself a girlfriend, Becky? I do and I don't, if you know what I mean. It usually means you don't, right? Yeah, <laughs> you're a perceptive guy. I got the lowdown on you from Elizabeth. Some guys I know have checked you out as well. I think me and you could get along. I need a guy like you on our team. Don't you got other guys to help you out? You're from here. You should know everyone. Well, that's the fucking problem. Everyone in the neighborhood help. And the whole fucking city knows us. You can't trust people. I only trust my family, some of them at least, and people I don't know. That's why you're on this job with me. Because you don't know me. That and you saved my life. Saving someone's life has got to count for something in this fucked up age we live in. That depends on the life, I guess. Tell you what, I'll snort a load of rails, fuck a lot of drunk girls, get into fights on a nightly basis, and die young leaving a scarred, bloated corpse. That sound like the sort of life worth saving? Most definitely. What the? Here we are. What's the plan? We get up on the roof of that. Follow me, Nico. They make these places easier to break into.
Hurry up, you bastard! What's the problem? <laughs> R.S. Hall will dump your load. These puns are deliberate and in jokes, usually of a sexual and questionable nature. I got a new strategy now. We're gonna use the sniper rifle to take most of them out. I'll get here on my own time. You gotta jump down there to get at him, man. I got another strategy.
Ooh. I just painted the wall with the brick. Having fun! We got the loot. Let's get out of here. Please, please don't. Tucky, get your ass in here. All right, Nico, you drive. I'll take out anyone who tries to follow us. We're going up to Ray's lockup in Westminster off of Union Drive West. Just a hop, skip, and a jump from here.
Nico? These cocksuckers are all over us! I thought you had the luck of the Irish. I fucking do! It's just that we've got your fucking Slavic driving skills as well! That's who we're gonna get out of this fucking jam! Uh, uh, Put that. your foot That's down, perfect. man! That's perfect. What the hell? Like Is it time to go here already? There's a box of grenades in here. Pass them up, Pecky. I'll give them a taste of their own fireworks. Stuff all in there. Sure is. All safe and sound. Whole truckload of it. A lot of wives and mistresses are gonna be happy when their men get a hold of those, huh? Whole city's gonna be hard in a few days' time. <laughs> Who's this? That's my boy Nico. He's an absolute savior. Couldn't have done it without him. Nico! Come over here. You work for these mick bastards. Fuck <laughs> I work for whoever's paying. I might give you a call sometime. Get in, Packy. Hey, so this is Ray I'll catch you around, man. Cop was just looking at me because I had, because uh, I was carrying the piece. Oh damn! I never see so many cops. Look at this. I better not commit a crime. I bet not commit a crime. This many cops out here. How are you allowed to walk the streets without help? You. Pull over, shitbag. Thank you for nothing. A typical Liberty City asshole. You wanna stop, man? Stop. All these cars, I can't get one. Do you wanna spend some money on Carmen? Oh, yes. I like the sound of that very much, Carmen. Give me that Wait for me at your place for an hour. You gonna have a good time tonight, Nico. Oh, I gotta get the car. Oh my shit, man. I'm gonna pull over by the burger shop. And then it gives me enough time to get a car. So can you take Swipe a car. Go steal a car. Oh fuck. I'd really like you to take me out. Oh no. Sure, I'll pick you up in the no, next I'm hour. In I'll count the seconds, Nico. Ah, 
Looks like I'm about to catch some karma. Oh, wait. She's gonna, she's gonna kill me. Forgive me, but I need this. Oh, take it easy. Two dates. Shit. Kiki, I don't like to do this, but something's come up. I can't go on a date with you. You're missing out, Nico. I'll have to have fun by myself. Driving like this. I should have driven like three of us. Me somewhere, Nico. <sighs> nice new expensive car, Nico. I like the new top, Nico. How much did it cost? I am glad to see you didn't try to save no money on those new pants of yours. Shit, Nico. I really need to get out of here. I need to move. You leaving Liberty City? How could I leave Liberty City? There's nowhere else to go. Except maybe Los Santos. Girl like me could do good there. Real good. A lot of people think that, Carmen. I'm not sure how true it is, though. It don't matter because Carmen ain't leaving Liberty City. She just needs to get her a place in Algonquin. They're so expensive, though. I can't afford that shit on my nurse's salary. Prices are crazy in Algonquin, but who cares? The other boroughs are more interesting. Bohan's just interesting if you don't got any aspirations. I want to live in the real Liberty City. I want to live in Algonquin. You couldn't rent me a place there, could you? If you got me a place, you'd have me all to yourself. Like we you could do. have a whole lot of fun. Carmen, I have enough problems looking after myself. I can't... This stuff is just so good, isn't it? I hope nobody sees us. <laughs> Yeah, I'll do that next time. I'm in a bit of a hurry. I'm gonna make it up to Kiki. Don't scare me. Want me to come inside with you? Come on, get in here. Hey. Now hold Carmen. Enjoy Carmen when you have her. 
Me gusta. Me gusta, papi. Papi. Was fun. Let's go see Packy again. But first, stop at ammunition. Oh, shit. Open your stupid eyes. Uh, the buffer to a Surprised that I had a call from Carver to go on the day before and then keep the calls me. I wasn't expecting that. You stay away from me. <laughs> Nico, what's this I hear about you running with Patrick McCreary now these days? He's got work. He's a good guy. You're not planning on taking him down, are you? Lay off him. For me. I'm not planning on taking him down. He's my damn brother, you idiot. Packy McCreary, Francis McCreary. It's all starting to make sense. I knew Irish families were big, but I didn't expect to run into brothers in a place the size of Liberty City. Yeah, just thank the Lord you ran into Packy and not my other brothers. Packy's <laughs> just a hood, but Gerald is into some serious shit. And Derek, he's the worst. If that asshole ever comes back from Ireland, I can't be held responsible for what I do. My brothers ain't no good, Nico. Trust me on that. You know what? Me and Packy get along. Maybe if doing what you do, yeah, I didn't mean to hang up on him, but hey, I wouldn't mind hanging up on him. Packy's a lot closer. Oh, in GTA 4, you don't get bulletproof tires, so the cops will shoot the shit out your vehicle, even if they had to pop your tires just to stop you. Let's use the back out. Then we'll go do another packing mission. We Let's sell quality weapons basics. and we know how to use them. The AK. Oh no. So, I didn't realize you like sluts. That's what she is, a slut, right? Do you want me to turn into a slutty whore for you? Baby, I don't know what you're talking about. I'll call you later, Kiki. Oh, Do you know no. what happens to those who piss on something sacred? Oh shit. I didn't expect uh, Kiki. I better get back in her good graces before she dumps me. I never find her to be jealous. Cancel. Never take her to be that jealous. It's a bit psycho. Yeah, 
Yeah, she's lonely and clingy. Stay safe. Stay Second Amendment. Jamie, 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 for fuck's sake, don't go outside. The place is crawling. Because I don't want to lose her benefit. Because this is kind of the friends with benefits with these uh, dates. Or dates with benefits more specifically. If I lose Kiki Jenkins, she dumps me. Or if I dump her for some whatever reason, I lose the, abil the ability there for her to call off the cops where if I lose uh, Carmen Ortiz I lose the health boost benefit but there is a third date or an, even a fourth date but the third date is Alex Chilton who is some kind of posh entitled uh, liberated woman that's her that's her uh online username and persona and blog blogging username. She has a clothing discount benefit. But then you can also date Captain McCreary. Kate McCreary. But the thing is is that she does not because of her strong Catholic faith, she does not put out like the other dates. She's not sexually active, so don't even try to make it pass it. Because as Packy said, she doesn't put out. So the plan was they were going to hide the diamonds in the queen's ass. <laughs> <laughs> oh, hey, Nico. Hey, Kate. Get your fucking hands off my fucking sister, boy. <laughs> We're talking not having casual sex, Patrick. I pray after the amount of practice you've had, you'd know the difference. Cool. Sure, she I know the difference. She implies that Patrick One leaves you feeling McCurry sad masturbates. and empty and alone, and the other's casual sex. <laughs> and I'm quite sure you and Mr. Nico here will have fun on your play date. See, and hey. as I said, Kate McCurry Coming and Patrick McCurry. Coming, Ma. You boys McCurry. play nice now. For sure. Hey. Okay. You ask on a date, she's oh, not we're gonna, gonna play going real for one nice. coffee. Let's put it that way. <laughs> They're clean as a fucking whistle. One previous owner, yeah. safely driven, ready for action. Just we like got an you, opportunity, my boy. Out. Yep, fortune favors the brave. Gotta make hay while the sun shines. So is you down, boy? Or is you out? Down for what? Down for robbing a thief. Robin Hood. Exactly. Robin Been fucking Hood. Who are you going to rob? The fucking mafia, yeah. boy. Hmm. Is the money good? What's the risk? Well, the risk is we all die a very slow and painful oh. death. Oh. <laughs> and the money is good. Very good indeed. So you in, big guy? Or we gonna have to kill you? Well, since you put it that way, I mean, right, good. all right, right, all right, let's yeah, go, on. let's do this. Can you get us a car, man? I'm afraid these two idiots can't drive for shit. Fuck you, Packy. Yeah, fuck you. Oh, about to do some hoodlum shit. Get your asses over here. Take us out to the waste management plant under the Algonquin Bridge on Colony Island, big man. This is gonna be a fun trip. Controlled waste management plant? You fucking guessed it. It's an Ancelotti operation. Ray tipped us off about a big payoff they just got. A fat cash payoff. 
Ancelotti's, huh? I can't tell none of those Watt families apart. Ancelotti's, Gambinos, Pecorinos. It's the fucking Pegarinos, man. We're working for them. Pecorinos are type of cheese. Pegorinos is a bunch of Guido gangsters out of Alderney. They're all mafia, though? Of oh, course they are. Jersey. Cosa Nostra and all that shit. Our family used to be bigger than all them mafia families put together. Back in the day, that is. Not this shit again. I heard this speech a million times. The McCreary's ran the city. People were scared to say their name, let alone come near their place in purgatory. Life was Hell's great. Purgatory. We were in charge. It's fucking true. I'd like to hear you tell Gerald that it's a boring story. My brother wouldn't take too kindly to that now, would he? You know the purgatory is called what it is because people were so scared of the McCreary's? Did you know that, Nico? It's called that because people found the McCreary's story so fucking boring. Listening to them was like being in purgatory. <laughs> Fuck you, Gordon. I'll fucking come purgatory back there and kick your fucking ass in a minute. I hear that Francis hell. McCreary is your brother. Fucking Frankie, my brother. Usually he may have a badge, Catholic but faith. I tell you for a fact, he's as crooked as the rest of us McCreary's. More so. At least we ain't fucking hypocrites. Kate's the only decent one. I can believe that. You know Frankie, do you? I got a story for you if you do. Another fucking story. Shut up, Gordon. So, Nico, when Francis and Gerald was growing up, Frankie becomes an altar boy. He swears to this day that he wanted to serve the Lord. Jerry knows the truth, though. He only put on that cassock so he could pocket the change in the collection plate. <laughs> Fact. That's Francis, down to a fucking T. I don't even know if he's still from the collection plate. That in, sounds in like the Francis McCreary I met. I bet. Motto Ultra community boy. leader, my ass. You're just worried he'll start clamping down on you, ain't you, Paggy? I'd like to see him try it. Not gonna happen with the things Jerry knows. Boys, moment of fucking truth. What the fight you want? You'll get it. Jesus, these fucking roads. All right, let's get in there. Let's get in on it. Got one in up there. Yeah. Take these fucking. Right here. Oh, 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 Nice hot grenade. Thanks for the grenades, Packy. Coming handy. Play of that for ya. Little potty kid. Boom, motherfucker. Oh, 
Bye, bitch. Oh, but that did. After you. Incendiary, the red clock. The song is you're gonna do. Didn't take a single hit so far, but I'm sure there's a lot of bad guys in there. Hello. Hey, Packy! I'm not in the room. Cover me, will you? Check on the sport. Shooting at the pallet jack. He's just like.
Fuck, I'm dead. Fuck. Taxi here. Okay, where to? We're going to Bismarck. Last eighteen minutes. Okay, of this yet problem. Thank you. Oh no. Chinatown. Great. Wait there and I'll come see you. I need you, Nico. Uh, you're starting to freak me out, Kiki. Don't come here. I'll call you later. Oh, shit. She's so neglected. I better take care of her. How is it going, man? Don't shoot at me now. Before I lose her. I can't afford to lose her. She has gone completely needy. I never expect her to be this cleany, but god damn.
It's Nico. You uh, want me to take you out on a date? Just when I'm starting to get over you, you calling it. It hurts me so much. But I'd really wait like to go later. on a date with you. Pick me up in the next hour. Can't wait, wait Kiki. I know she can't. She's getting needy. I need to show her some attention. Please make a U turn. We're safe. I've been looking forward to this so much. Let's go. <laughs> sort of car you should be driving. I hope that top wasn't expensive, Nico. Ugh, new pants, I see. Sometimes when I'm having a fun time, even a fun time with a crazy man like you, I feel so guilty. Why? Because some people are having a miserable time, I guess. I don't know. There will always be people who suffer, Kiki. That is the way of the world. Yes, but I want to help. Do you not think it is vain to think that you can make a difference? To think it is your concern? But I feel so guilty. Life is so unfair. And you've come out okay. You should be grateful. How can I be grateful when I'm in so much pain? Thank you, Nico. I knew you'd understand. In 400 yards, turn right. And these gas stations, like in New York, from what I hear, is that you never get out your car to pump your gas. They, the attendants do it for you. So that way they service the line and expedite the business. There we go. The reason why they do that. Driving on the wrong side of the road. That's great. Okay, cool. I'm gonna wait. Here we go again. You have arrived. Nice, Nico. But anywhere'd be nice with you. A traditional diner. What do you think you are? Sorry, 
got ran into. I enjoyed that, Nico. You're a good conversationalist. Calculating route. Calculating route. Take me back home and get in their good graces. And her pants. <laughs> Turn right. Turn left. In 100 yards. Turn Some of these are right. Rest, rest, rest. Oh, I wish I had a long look deal. Don't know what diesel is, but I gather it's the kind of Some kind of yellow. significance of the name burger shot turn is it's actually right. of a sexual nature which I don't really care too much to discuss you have arrived like urban dictionary type stuff it would uh, mean a lot to me if I could come inside Kiki this is going to be amazing I might cry with happiness <laughs> Minus jack that car. There's also the dealership. That's a cute me anytime. Nico. Oh, Nico. I love you, Nico. She doesn't get too attached. Uh, she's already getting attached. Too late for that. Hey, you asleep? Move! No, I'm not, motherfucker. So. The last five minutes of the stream. I want to thank anyone for tuning in or watching this on replay. Let's go see the paper man. Turn right. Portrait of a killer. Come in, Nico. Hi. So, you fought in the war. You know a lot. Yes, you're looking for some people. We're all looking for that special someone. But most of us don't want to kill them when we find them. Most murders are committed by people you know. Most wives are killed by their husbands. Yes, and my wife had better stop sleeping with that tennis coach or... <laughs> I'm joking. <laughs> I'm sure your wife doesn't need to sleep around. Well, I'm joking. I'm sure she does. Funny. <laughs> I'm divorced. My wife can sleep with whoever she wants. Interesting. I'm not divorced. I was never married. No details. I need you to go find someone for me. I'll be getting a picture through shortly. This is important. So why use me? We always use people like you. Karen, Michelle, she was the same. Someone with something to lose, but not much to live for. What's in it for me? Two things. One, you don't get a hundred murders pinned on you. Two, maybe I will help you. Maybe I won't. 
Now get access to a police computer and wait for my message. Go. Adam DeMaye. Do this, I have to call the police. Messages. Newspaper, newspaper. Hello. Hello, this is the LCPD. Where would you like us to send an officer? Uh, the triangle. An LCPD peacekeeper will be there as soon as possible, sir. gonna do it for this edition of let's play classic featuring grand theft auto 4 on the 9 to 5 outlaw does gaming youtube and twitch channel i'll be back tomorrow at the same time until then i'm kill the vid for the 9 to 5 outlaw does gaming youtube and twitch channel and please stay safe